Hello everyone, it's Armand Matikian again from Amber Professional Development. And in this video, I would like to provide you a quick preview of the central topic that we will cover in our second session of Consulting for Growth on July the 22nd. In the path to trusted advisor that we introduced in our first session, the first three steps relate to establishing trust. Step four is the bridge or inflection point that earns you the right to provide advice. And this is achieved by enhancing, contributing to, and provoking your client's thinking. The reason why provoking your client's thinking is so important is because it positions you from being perceived as an order taker to an order shaper, an influencer, and ultimately a trusted advisor. The difference between the two is that order takers ask their client what keeps them up at night, whereas all the shapers tell their clients what should be keeping them up at night. In our next session, we will explore how to create points of view that can offer a new perspective to engage your senior stakeholders and provoke their thinking. It is not sufficient to state a general observation of an industry or point to obvious trends that you, your stakeholders, and even your competitors already know about. Your point has to be sharp if it is to capture the attention and imagination of senior executives. Sharp stands for significant in its scale and scope, so it warrants your client's attention. Hypothesis-based, showing that you've hypothesized and tested possible outcomes that could impact your client's business. Actionable, so the client is able to mitigate against the risks that you've identified. Relevant to the client context and their care abouts. And finally, provocative, so you're shining a light on a blind spot that the client may have on this topic. A sharp point of view changes the client's frame of reference by helping them to see that instead of pursuing one route, they should be pursuing another. At our next meeting, we will start by reviewing the key learnings from the first session. Our focus, however, will be how to sharpen our points of view so we can challenge and enhance our clients' thinking in a manner that represents us as trusted advisors. I would therefore be grateful if you could come prepared with some of the most important issues facing your clients today so we can together develop perspectives and points of view that will differentiate you from your competitors and position you as peers and thinking partners for your most senior clients. I look forward to seeing you again on the 22nd.